solve 4t minus 10t squared equals 0. We have a quadratic equation because of the t squared term. So we're going to use the principle of zero products. And we're going to want to factor. We have a zero on one side, so we factor this. And we begin by looking for a common factor, and there is one. That's 2t. So I write 2t times 2, 2, which is a 2, minus 5t. And that's equal to 0. Now, there are two factors here. This is a factor, and 2t is a factor. So when we use the principle of zero products, we need to set 2t equal to 0. And we also need to set 2 minus 5t equal to 0. If we divide both sides by 2, we get t equals 0. And here we also want to solve for t. Subtracting 2 from both sides gives us negative 5t equals negative 2. Dividing both sides by negative 5 gives us t equals 2 fifths. Both 2 fifths and 0 would check in the original equation. So we say the solutions are 0 and 2 fifths.